kids, can I get more chairs and tablecloths, please, from you? Uh, sure. All right, we'll have Susie Whaley on macrame again this year. No, no, dear, that doesn't go on this table. So, do you like being an boy? Um, not really. Hey, but I look like a dork in those gowns, eh? A little. <laughs> yeah, well, my mom made me join. My mom made me join the choir. Uh, well, the only good thing about being an altar boy is uh, I can get a ball of altar wine anytime I want. Really? Yeah. So can you get me some? Well, me and the guys are going to be sharing a bottle at the fundraiser. If you want to come, I mean, you don't have uh, to. Sure. Get me in. Someone joins us for the wine tasting at the fundraiser. Who, your gay boyfriend? <laughs> yeah, your gay boyfriend? Yeah, you. Come here, give me a kiss. <laughs> okay, we're it's that Donna girl from the choir. Come on. Come on. Yeah, sure. As long as she only drinks your share. And you gotta steal the wine. Ah! You cut me! No, I didn't. It was nails on your cross. Okay, first blood. You die! Ah! Guys! <laughs> Boys. Hey, Nan. Hey, Nan. Hello, Miss Miller. Jose. Hello, Sean. Hello, Mrs. Miller. I had a nice visit with your father today. In jail? Yes, in jail, and he asked me to give you this. Cool painting. Shut up, Jose. He's wondering when you're going to come and visit him. Oh, uh, how about never? Come on, guys. Let's go. Terry, you don't mean that. He's your father. Neil really wants to see you. Do you know Wayne Little, Sean? Uh, Wayne? Well, sort of. Not really. Well, at the Catholic Women's Association meeting today, Cindy Dupuy told me he might be on drugs. Apparently, the Littles were at home eating dinner last night. In front of the television. I mean, what sort of family eats dinner in front of the television? There's something wrong with that, in my opinion. When in walks Wayne, dripping wet, holding a fish from the neighbor's koi pond. Hi, I'm home. I don't want you hanging around that boy. I don't. Oh, unbelievable. I mean, we did crazy things when we were kids, but nothing like that. What are you doing, Tom? Nothing. We're just talking about firecrackers, jumping off bridges. Your mother's right. Stop hanging around with that Wayne little kid, OK? I'm so glad you became an altar boy, Sean. Yep. Best thing that ever happened to you. Hey, Wayne. Can I talk to you a second? Sure. Get it. Get it. What the hell did you run for? I wasn't running. I heard you brought home a fishy present for your little sister. Did you tell anyone where you bought the acid? No, you know I wouldn't tell anybody I bought it from you guys. You didn't buy it from us. Ah! Hey, hey, no, uh, uh, 
Did you tell anyone? No, I swear. If I find out you were lying, I'll let Jose lay a novena on you. Got it? Yeah. Screw you guys. What? Come here! What the hell? Did you say to me? Hey, Sean. So, uh, where's, where's your girlfriend? Oh, Mrs. Wong, I'm so glad you could make it. Did your brother not manage to come? Harry is over there. Huh? Oh, he doesn't see me. Okay, Sean. It's time to get the wine. Neil gets first taste. All right? Uh, two brownies, please. Uh, good. <laughs> oh, Father. Should you be having brownies with your diabetes? Why don't you try Mrs. DeHonick's lemon bars? They're dietetic. No sugar. Thank you. You're welcome. Thursday is my turn. Your girlfriend show up yet? What for you? So you girls want to see me run up a wall? Stand back. See that? I ran up a wall. Jose, we got a problem. Come on. Later. D O N G O. D O N G O. And Donna was her name. You know, I expect this from this idiot, not you. Yeah. Because you're an idiot. Go on, give me the bottle. No, it's for Donna. All right, Sean, you've had enough. No. Get the bottle from me. Come on. Come on. Give us the bottle, Sean. Donna. Run. What are you boys up to? Nothing, Father. Bullshit. You're all liars. You come into confession with your lies, you think I don't know you're making it all up? Lies. Not one real sin. You cowards. Put your hands out. All of you. You need a good strapping. Young Sean Gallagher. What would your mother have to say about such behavior? Horsing around in a church. Father, please don't tell my mom. It's too late for that now. Don't move. I'll be right back. Liars. All of you.
Oh, this is stupid. How long are we supposed to stand here? Probably getting my mom. Are you praying? No, oh, man, I got the spins. Terry. And where are you going? I told us not to move. Father? It's okay, he's passed out. Looks like there was a little wine tasting going on here, too. Whoa, hey, Father Brian, your drinking buddy's throwing up. <laughs> Liar. <laughs> Liar. <laughs> Yes, the bazaar was a huge success. I'm Laura. Hello. Hey, I'm really sorry I didn't come to the fundraiser. My dad slammed his thumb in the door and he had to take me to the hospital and stuff. Did you guys get the wine? Yeah. Really? Wow. Could have gotten drunk. Are you feeling okay? Oh, yeah. No, not really. Open your hymn books to hymn number 182. I have never been so embarrassed in all my life. Did you apologize to Father Sand? Sorry, Father. He shouldn't be apologizing to me. He should be asking for God's forgiveness. What is wrong with you, Sean? Is something wrong with you? No, nothing. It's just, I f it was hot and I just fainted. Do you realize that a, a consecrated host touched the ground? Is this how you set about becoming a priest? Because I'm telling you, a, a priest would never desecrate this holiest of places. It, it, it's blasphemy. You want to become a priest? <sighs> and so it begins. <laughs> 